all right so we're back as you just saw unloaded a whole another load of stuff and i figure i brought some uh cleaning supplies with me some of the stuff is super dusty so i need to go ahead and clean it off also i uh, need to clean that glass off so i can put that uh display case together start trying to lay out the room but um yeah one day at a time ladies and gentlemen one day at a time all right so the current situation i was hoping this rack would fit underneath there it doesn't so i'm gonna have to move that cabinet up which looks like there's some plates up there we'll, we'll figure that out um i did ask if this room has like cable and what's that for is this cable tv or is that cable to hook up a router there is wi-fi in the whole area and that's included so i'm not sure what that's for i don't really need cable tv but you know better to know um so gotta raise that up slide this over there got some i don't know exactly where that's gonna go need to clean all that off need to clean this glass all off got some glass cleaner with me need to start going through these bins set the uh the shelves up inside the display case also for right now i've got a little folding table that i can put back there yeah gotta make some progress need to bring my tripod in here because there's not a really good spot to set up the phone at the moment but i'm gonna do a little bit of work might get some time lapses might not and uh yeah be right back All right, so I got the glass in this thing and it about kicked my butt. Um, still some streaks where it's it's all drying, but I tried, I cleaned all the glass off, got it all set up, set the shelf about halfway up. Don't know exactly how I'm gonna display stuff in there yet. Might end up, end up printing out like some GPU stands and set up a bunch of GPUs in there. But yeah, that was, that was a big thing is I wanted to get uh, that thing all set up because all this glass laying around was definitely not safe now i need to get this back to the back and start shuffling through a lot of that yeah fun stuff all right so here's one of the boxes i started cleaning out the mining shed and ran into all kinds of stuff so a little display some ram in it need to print out some more of these because I need one for like DDR4, maybe a couple for DDR4. And then some of these are DDR3. And I think maybe some of these old ones are, are DDR2. But for right now, you know what? I mean, I guess we can set those in the display case. Like, need to get me a good compressed air, like duster deal, you know? Oh yeah, she's not that dirty. I guess we could set that bad boy right there. Um, but yeah, we got we got lots of stuff in here. Old 570s that need to be cleaned up. I believe this is a, yeah, another 570. Uh, this is a 5500 XT. So we'll kind of set these aside. I'm thinking, like, obviously this chair is not going to stay here, but I'm thinking a little corner table right here would, would be nice, definitely. And then some high shelves over here behind me would probably be nice. A little wireless card. I'll just throw that in there for now. Look at that 1070 Ti. That's a nice little one right there. Another 570. Got a bunch of those. Another 570. I brought a lot of my old cards over here initially. Probably not going to bring a bunch of new stuff. 
just because like a lot of people had mentioned it's a lot of risk leaving everything in here um, obviously there's security cameras uh, in and out of the building um, I have a security camera coming for in here as well um, so just to be extra secure and extra safe I think that's a 5600 XT there's a 20 series right here a little bit newer 2070 so I guess that's enough for right now I can start cleaning some of these bad boys up I need to get those bank chairs out of here but yeah it's uh it's getting there thinking get these bank chairs out of here i'm gonna hang a little small tv or small monitor right there have a, a tiny little table that comes out um with like maybe a test bench right here i don't know maybe a test bench over there makes more sense or in that corner gotta have a test bench probably in that corner honestly um but i, w I really wanted a spot for people to like set up a system and test it out and maybe that's going to be right here just because it's over in this corner. This is a weird dugout area. So this might end up being it. So that way they can have just enough for a keyboard, a mouse, have the system down below, have cables run down to it. So you can just plug it in, test it out. If they like it, good. If it fits, it ships. I still have to go through all this stuff. I mean, we got motherboards and CPUs, power supplies. And this is just a small fraction. Oh, I still have to finish cleaning out the mining room. But I figure if I do a truckload at a time, eventually, eventually we'll get there. So, yeah. Um, I guess I'm going to get to cleaning a little bit. And I really need to... This table is, like, all stained and stuff. I don't really like that. I need to try to clean that up with something or maybe just get a new table. But for right now, it works because everything's so, you know, nasty and dusty. But I guess I'll see y'all here in a little bit. Peace. All right, guys. So made a little progress over here. Started going through. Got some cards cleaned up. Got some motherboards and CPUs cleaned up. Just stuck them in there for the time being. Have a huge backlog of stuff to clean. Still got that box. This box. Got a box up here with GPUs, tons of stuff to go through. Sorry about that. I had a phone call, but um, yeah, so I found in my stash so far, 2070 Super, 2070. That's just one of those 1660 Supers. <clears throat> tons of 570s, some 55 and 5600 XTs. That is a regular 3060, but it's an Aorus edition. It's like super big fans and stuff for a super low power card. Uh, 3060 Ti. I um, think that's a, another 3060 Ti, 1070 Ti, some older cards in there. I think the majority of these are older too. Oh, some newer, some 16s and that kind of thing. But yeah, I still have uh, tons of rigs to break down, tons of power supplies to break down. Um, I pretty much have decided over on this side of things, uh, I am going to try, I'm going to bring my drill gun tomorrow or maybe tonight, might come back tonight slide that cabinet up and move this up underneath that uh, just to have some more storage over here as I break things down. And then <coughs> I need to run some shelving up top that way um, because I don't need, you know, say I have one, two, three, four. I know I have more, more than that of the identical RX 570. I don't need every single 570 in the display case. Um, we only need one 570 in the display case and the rest can go up top in the shelving. So, um, yeah, yeah, absolutely. Also, I need to get my 3d printer fired back up and print me some more, um, of these little Ram holders cause I'm breaking everything down and I'm coming across a lot of Ram and I need to split it up by like generation and stuff. And yeah, fun, fun. Um, also, uh, I, I went on Amazon and I found a good, little uh like side table or desk that i'm gonna put right there uh i think i'm gonna end up using that laptop up here that's my one of my older laptops but still in good shape i just have to buy another power brick adapter because i cannot find the one for that one of course they all use different ones i don't know why laptops won't 
make a standard barrel plug. Everybody has to have their own, but yeah, I guess for now, I'm gonna take one of these home because I don't, I definitely don't need two of them in here and I think I'll leave one. I'm not sure why I need to leave one. I don't, I don't know. I'm like so undecided on these chairs. They're like out of place, but then, yeah. Anyway, all right. Later guys, see y'all in the next one. Adios. <laughs> well, uh, I got a whole nother load of stuff. Loaded the truck down, got all kinds of parts and graphics cards. Let's see, there's all kinds of stuff, power supplies. I was gonna come back to the office and um, start going through stuff and start cleaning it up. It's super late. Wife went ahead and went to work, or went to bed. Um, and I get over here and I'm, I, must be, I must be dumb. I don't know, I can't figure it out. But they have like a key fob system. So the doors are open from seven to five. And after five, they have a key fob that like unlocks, unlocks the door. I can't get my key fob to work. So I drove like 20 minutes out here and I can't get the key fob to work. It's like almost 1 a.m. She said the key fob would work anytime after five or before seven. I figured that meant like I'd be good at 1 a.m. But uh, yeah, so I guess this video is getting cut a little short, guys. Um, I mean, like I got, you know, some ch little cheapo shelving units and stuff that I pulled out of the garage. The truck is slam packed. And the worst part of this situation is me and my wife want to go to the fair tomorrow and take the truck and it's slam packed full of stuff. So now I got to get back home and unload it. I don't know, maybe we'll just, we'll take her car instead of taking the truck. But um, yeah, I just, I thought it was comical. I, I needed to let you guys know. But anyway, everything's going good. Um, I went ahead and got the ball rolling on a few things. So hopefully you'll see those on the next video. Anyway, guys, y'all have a good one. I'll see you on the next one. Adios.